Hello friends, today I am going to show you how to make a better button or improve your buttons. So let's get started. First, I'm going to get, I mean, I'm going to scratch.mit.edu. I don't do that much programming. So let's click on create. Let's delete this. Now. Okay, now it's kind of loading. Uh, let's wait. Okay. Now you can see I have scratch two, but actually scratch one, I just change it from scratch or add ons and beta three point. What is that? Beta three point. Beta three point. So let's delete our scratch cat. And let's paint the new sprite and name this play or anything you want. I'll name this play. P L A Y. Play. Okay, now let's kind of zoom in. Then pick the rectangle tool. Then choose a color. I will choose a green color or a turquoise color. Turquoise. Uh, here we go, turquoise, a little darker turquoise or so like a lighter turquoise. Then I'll make it a box. Okay, now let's give the outline white, then it'll kind of look better. Bit R. Okay. Now let me make this outline wide. Okay, I think you, you guys are having hard to see. So let's go to Big Mac mode, not in vector, just Big Mac. Then just click on the fill bucket and make the backdrop black to see it, to see the outline. Then, then take the text tool and make this white. Uh, I think I'm going to name this play, but I want to type it start, S-T-A-R-T, -T, I guess, but still play, E-L-A-Y, play. Now let's click the outside for deselecting it. Now let's make it a little long. Okay. I think I should make this a uh, longer. Okay, put it in the center. Now I'm going to give some outlines. Two will be better. Then I'll make this white. You can see it's looking better. Then I'm going to duplicate it by right clicking, not left clicking, right clicking and click on duplicate. Now I'll make this turquoise. I'll make this turquoise. Okay, purpose, and let's go to fill bucket because it's more easy. Now let's fill, take topo, take topoise again, and fill the inside with this white so let's fill it and see it's looking kind of better now it's not done actually so you can um, just name this one two then you can remember it i actually named them like this so next, I'll give you a, when the green flag is clicked, when the green flag is clicked. So, because I'm going to hide the button over here. So, so then I'll give you a forever. 
if else, if then, if touching mouse pointer then, let's add a beautiful sound to it for hovering. Have this beautiful pop sound. Let's like cut it from here. Here's a good pop sound. A little sure. Cut it into. Let's make it a little more. Cut it from here. I can cut it like here. No. More cut. This is more better. Now I'll give you a play sound. This until done. Was play sound this until done? Let's see. What will happen? Actually, it's a clicking sound. So let's change the costume to costume two. Then we'll change it to costume one, which is the normal, normal button and the hovering button, hovering look, and the normal look. Now we can see that it's working. But one problem, we can make it. One problem, it's it's not being being big and small. Just let me set the size to like um one hundred and oops one hundred and twenty and it's still kind of big. Then I will add the size, but not normally I'll take change size then a minus operator and a divided by operator and put it right here then i'll put here in the center i'll put here size um i'll put here the number how i want it how much i want it to be can make it big so i'll put here 130 100 and 130 and smooth it up and it will be smooth if i give you a five or three i will give you a five now in the normal size i will give you a 120 and also five and you can see it's very big okay 100 was good One hundred plus two hundred. So you can see what this belong. It's very large. How about this goes down? Check. It's going to be one hundred. Let me see the problem. I done this a lot of time, and why it's not working? This should be one hundred. Be one hundred. And why it's being so much larger? Hmm. Let's check. Okay. Is this maybe? Let me pause it for a minute. <laughs> now I am back. I ate delicious meals. Now I am back. I'm not going to say what I ate, but I will say I ate delicious meals. So let's. Let's click the green flag. Now you can see it's kind of better, but not that smooth. It's kind of lagging, but still I'll say it's working. Because I change size by, this is not working. Change 
size bar is not working. But set, set size bar is working. I made them a bigger number than you, can, you guys can see better. See? It's working, but still kind of lagging. Now it's better. Five is the winner. See, set is working, but but change is not working. Now let's let's add a sound. Now let's go. We are going to go here and put here. When the sprite is click, when the sprite is click, start sound pop, and <clears throat> then height, then height, height. Now I'm going to click the green flag and you can see it's a beautiful effect and a nice smooth effect. Now I am going to click it. Now it's gone. I kind of want to give your effect, which I put it in my backpack. It's an interesting one and very long one and very hard to get it. So I like backpacked it. I think this is the one. Let's see, is it the one? Yes. This is the script. We can just. This is the script. What is it? What I made, I can see it's kind of like jumping. It's beautiful effect and get rid of this, but without this, it will not work. You can like just copy it and then you can like pause the video and copy it because it's a very hard one and very long to get. And I'm not going to make this very well animation, so you can just take it out how long it is. If you're done. You can just pause the video. Now you can see your button is kind of improved. See, it's improved. So I hope you guys like it. Subscribe to my channel and give us a big like. Uh, I hope you guys like it. So bye. Whatever I can say. Bye.